Well, good morning, folks. It's a cold day. It's windy. It's one day after a front, which we had a pretty good amount of rainfall. And tomorrow, there's another front that's going to give us some rain. So we're in between fronts, right in the middle. And uh, today, or this morning, it is uh, 31 degrees. That's cold. The temperature went way down last night. And believe it or not, my wife wants to go fishing out in this. Now, uh, she takes cold weather a lot better than I do. She always has. Uh, but we'll see. And i got to bring Boondog with us. So this is all about just fishing. And really, I'm going to tell you all the truth. I would rather catch fish and release them. I'm not a big fish eater. She loves them. She's, she's going with me to make sure we bring back some fish. Okay. So that's what this is all about. But uh, love it. Uh, we're just going to catch. We're going to catch whatever we can because these is pretty bad conditions, really. In between fronts can be tough a lot of times, but we're just going to do what we can do. And uh, come with us. <laughs> Let's see if we can catch a fish. Hey, you ready to catch a fish? Yes. My goodness, what a beautiful day or morning. It's foggy and the water temp, surface temp is 51 degrees. I mean, it really fell last night. The surface temp was around 56. So it was a cold night last night. All right, we're gonna go hunt some fish. We don't care what they are. Long as Boomer can have some to eat right here. A scooby doo be doo be doo a scooby doo be doo be doo a doo be doo be doo Let's go catch them. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Alright, we're going to start off this morning with four pound line right here. And this is a cadence rod. It's a CR7. Six foot three long medium light extra quick tilt or extra fast tilt i'm using a bobby garland and an ultimate jig head made by four by four and i'm just going to start casting this morning just to see if there's any fish in the neighborhood there we go first fish of the day but it ain't a crappie it's a yellow stripe. Now, them are good eating fish. Really? Yeah, you want to keep it? Get a couple of fillets off of that one, no doubt. All right, we'll put them in the bucket, cold as it is. I didn't bring a cooler. This bucket will be good enough. Cold water. <coughs> oh. You got him? Oh my goodness, Lisa. Mama Lisa's got one. Mama Sue. It acts like a, I don't know. Yeah, it's a little bluegill and that's too little to eat. He's pretty though, ain't he? Yeah, there's a lot of yellow strap out there. I can't get a hook into him. Their little mouth is little. Well, that is a pretty good size one. One would call for a yellow stripe. There's a fish. That's a yellow stripe. I can tell kind of that sledgehammer. See, see what I'm talking about? They're kind of hitting short. There we go, folks. Little yellow stripe right there. Them fly out. They taste maybe not as good as a crappie, but they're close. There we go. That's a crappie. 
That's a good one, too. Yep. All right, Mama Lisa, it's your turn. That's a big one, ain't it? That fish hit real, real light. If it wasn't for that high-vis line, I wouldn't have seen that one right there, folks. That's a good one. We don't normally keep crappie, but we're going to because who needs them, Lisa? Brenda. Brenda needs them. So we're going to put that crappie in there for Brenda. Let's put him in the bucket. We got all kinds of stuff in here, folks. We got white stripe, yellow stripe, uh, two crappies in there. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff. Brenda don't never get no fish, so Mama Lisa or Mama Sue's been after me to get them. So that's what we're doing. Let's catch another one. There's one. There's another crappie. They're about two foot deep. Oh, and we got him on that ultimate jig head made by four before. So he's going to stay buttoned up. No doubt. Look at there, what a crappie. They, Brenda's going to eat. Woo! Okay. <laughs> Yep, yeah, Brenda's gonna eat. That's a nice one right there. Let's put him in the bucket. There ain't nothing to it. Okay, just fill the bucket full of all kinds of aquatic life there. Elmo! I have to catch a couple before I... There he is. That's a good fish right here. This is a good crappie right here. Oh my, 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 my. Look here. That's a slab daddy. Okay. Ooh. I want y'all to look what a crappie. Woo! I ain't nothing like it, mama. Okay. That's a monster. That's a monster fish. Let's put him in the bucket. Now, she's been wanting fish for how many years? <laughs> well, she can get some now. I guarantee you. You hung right there, babe. Uh -huh. You hung right here. You hung right here. You hung right here. Here's your rod. Here's your rod, hon. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's another fish. Now this is a pretty good crappie, but it ain't like the last one. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know it's a habit, folks. What it is, I've keyed in right here. I'm trying to figure these fish out now. I, I have figured them out. Now they've had it. That's a good fish right there. That's a good fish. Hey. Let's put him in the bucket. <laughs> it's a good fish, folks. All right, let me see if we can put this lid on here. You got a lot of fish to clean. Wait. Cleaning them. Excuse me? I ain't cleaning them. Well, who's going to do it? There we go. That's a crappie too. Yep. If it wasn't for this high vis line, I'd have some trouble today. They just they'll hit it, folks, and they'll just swim with it towards you. It's a good fish too. That is a big crappie. Okay. 
Golly, I'm a little bit jealous of Brenda. She's going to eat now. <laughs> Folks. <laughs> My goodness, what a crappie. Woo! They ain't nothing like it. Okay. Hey, man. They ain't nothing like the sport of fishing. Look at there. They. Let's put him in the bucket in there along with them others. Okay, let's catch another one. Real simple. Ultimate jig head. 132nd ounce made by 4x4. Four four. And this is a blue ice. Bobby Garland. I'm going back to my roots, folks, where I started. Okay. Going back to the beginning. It always ends up that way. Look here. My goodness. Woo! I'm sorry, Lisa. I can't help it. I'm doing everything in the world, folks, to coach her into catching one. And them little strap keeps messing with her more than anything, don't they? We got a slab tail on hers and a Bobby Garland on mine, and it just seems like... Look here, what a crappie. Hey, it just seems like that Bobby Garland is paying off today. Now, tomorrow, it could be the slab tail. But that's just the fact of the matter. Now, let's talk about facts on this channel. Facts. Put it in here. It makes a big difference. It makes a big difference. All right, folks, that's the end of it. I've had a great day on the water with my wife and Boomer. And uh, I tell you what, they ain't nothing like it out here. Thank y'all for the great comments. Lisa didn't catch any crappie today, but she caught a bunch of strap and what? What all did you catch today? Just a strap. Just a strap, but you had fun? Yeah, I did. Okay, she had fun. That's what counts. I'll catch crappie in the springtime. <laughs> They were scattered today, but uh, Bobby Garland jig done the trick. One thirty-second ounce four by four jig. Hey, and like I say, thank y'all very much. And <laughs> woo! Cause it's good!